Congratulations. Congratulations. Congratulations and welcome to NYU. NYU has among the highest number of international students of any university in the US. And we're so, so glad that you're now part of this diverse community. Let's take a moment to talk about some of the legal requirements you should know as an international student in the US. Number one, make sure you keep your immigration documents valid at all times. By valid, we mean accurate and unexpired. So be sure to keep an eye on the expiration date of your passport in your I-20 or DS 2019. Keep in mind that your passport must be valid at least six months into the future at all times. If your passport is expiring soon, renew it with your country's consulate in the US or in your home country. Your I-20 or DS 2019 must also be accurate and unexpired. And you must keep all original I-20s or DS-2019s ever issued to you in a safe place. If any information is incorrect, or you need to update anything on your I-20 or DS-2019, contact the Office of Global Services. Number two, enroll full-time every fall and spring semester. As an undergraduate, you need to enroll in 12 or more credits during the fall and spring semesters to be considered a full-time student. If you're a graduate student, your requirements might be a little different, so check with your academic department to be sure. Only one online course may count towards your full-time enrollment requirement in any fall or spring semester. If you think you need to enroll less than full-time, you need to get OGS approval before your registration is finalized. If you're not sure whether you're eligible or not, either check with the OGS website or talk to your academic advisor. Number three, keep a US address and phone number in Albert at all times. If you move or change your phone number, you will need to update your information at Albert within 10 days. Number four, have health insurance while you are a student at NYU. If you have your own insurance plan that meets the university criteria, you can work with the Student Health Insurance Office to find out what documentation you need in order to waive the coverage provided by the NYU Sponsored Student Health Insurance Plan. Number five, provide the NYU Student Health Center with records of your immunizations. Not doing so might get you de-enrolled from your classes. Number six, don't start work off campus without permission. You'll need to get the okay from either the government or OGS before starting work off campus. When looking for a job off campus, Please keep in mind that you generally need to have completed two full semesters before you are eligible to do so, and that your job or internship must be related to what you're studying. Number seven, obey all laws during your stay in the United States. This includes local, state, and federal laws. Number eight, avoid receiving government funding or benefits. As an international student, accepting benefits like Medicaid, food stamps, or subsidized housing can result in the loss of student status and prevent you from re-entering the United States. Number nine, carry all required documents with you when traveling and re-entering the US. As an international student, you'll need to be sure to take these documents with you. Passport with F1 or J1 visa, I-20 or DS-2019, service fee receipt, proof of financial support, enrollment verification. Okay, these are the basic legal requirements you'll need to be aware of during your time at NYU. And remember, if you have any questions, we're always happy to help.